hello viewers welcome back to another video so in this video we're gonna talk about what is redirects and uh, how to set up 301 and 302 redirects in your wordpress website so if you are new here consider subscribing let's start the video all right we are back on our computer screen so uh, first let's talk about what is a redirect a redirect is a simple way of sending your users and the search engines to a different URL than the URL they have requested. For example, if you type in google.com in the search bar, so when you type Google, it is taking you to the Google. So when you have redirected, it will take your visitors to a different website. For example, so there are basically three types of redirects. One is 301 and 302 and the third one is meta refresh we're not gonna talk about meta refresh in this video because uh, nobody is using it in 2021 so basically we're gonna talk about 301 and 302 let me explain you what is a 301 redirect 301 redirect is a permanent redirect that uh, passes all the link juice i mean the link authority to the new uh, url that you have redirected for example, the, you have a website called abc.com and now if you want to transfer it to xyz.com, you will set a 301 redirect in abc. So every time somebody visit this website, they will be automatically redirected to xyz.com. Okay, and not only that, it will show in the search engines, it will tell the search engines and the users that the page or the URL or the website is permanently moved to this uh, new URL and this will also pass all the value and all the search ranking signals to the new URL and 302 is called temporary redirect when you are moving something on your website when you're doing some maintenance and uh, if some if your content is broken and you want to temporarily move this move your traffic from this page to another page you will use a 302 temporary redirect now let me show you how you can use redirects on your WordPress website. So to do this, you need to log into your hosting account and open the cPanel. As you can see, we are on our cPanel. Just navigate to domains and select redirects. So we are on the redirect settings. First, you have to select the redirect type. If you want a permanent redirect, just select permanent 301. Or if you are doing it temporarily, you can select the temporary 302 and select the domain. Let me select my domain and here enter the address you want to redirect. I will select my block spot address and then click on add. So our redirect is added. Click on go back. And if you scroll down, you can see all your redirects here. As you can see, this is my domain tipswithalam.com and this is the redirect URL so every time somebody visit this URL they will be automatically redirected to my new URL so this is called 302 which is temporary so let's see how it works I will open a incognito mode and visit my website and as you can see it is redirected to my blogspot website so this is how 302 and 301 works if you want a permanent redirect just select the permanent redirect so uh, it is always recommended to use 301 because it helps you with the seo and the search ranking and everything so if you want to delete this uh, redirect just click on delete and select remove redirect now your redirect is removed if you open a new tab and check you will see that uh, redirect is removed. It is taking us to our own website. So this is how the redirects work. Now, if you want to redirect within your website, it's quite easy. Same procedure with some changes. Just select the redirection type. I will select temporary and select the domain. I will select the same domain. And here you need to enter your directory. For example, uh, if I want uh, people to click on my about page and uh, go to contact, I will just copy this page name and uh, paste it over here and then enter the redirection address. So I will select my redirection address as my contact page. 
just copy this full URL and uh, paste it here in redirects to and click on add the redirection is successfully added go back and if you scroll down you can see that uh, this is our domain and this is the directory so every time somebody visit the about page they will be redirected to the contact page and this is also a temporary redirect because uh, I don't want to do it permanently but uh, for you if you are moving the page permanently please use 301 because it helps you with the SEO and uh, uh, it, it is it is preferred by all the SEOs around the world so now if you want to delete this same procedure just click on delete and uh, remove redirect so this is how redirects work on WordPress and uh, the cPanel if you have any questions leave them in the comments down below and if you want uh, more videos on cPanel and WordPress and SEO you can check out my channel thank you so much for watching I will see you in the next video take care bye bye